You're about to meet the spider equivalent of a stealthy jungle cat. This Virginian specimen is the jumping spider, and it packs a ton of stalking, pouncing, killing firepower in its tiny body. Here's the victim, this bee. The jumping spider locks onto the prey and begins the remarkably sophisticated ritual of capture. The jumping spider can track the bee because of its eight eyes, including these on the back of its head. No matter where the bee is, it's on the jumping spider's radar screen. The spider can't move its eyes, so it moves its body to see. Two huge front eyes track the kill. Even if the eyes can't move, the retinas inside the eyes can. See, that play of light and darkness is the spider looking around. The bee has a huge mobility advantage, but the spider is craftier. Now, if this were a slasher film, the audience would be screaming, look out, behind you! But the bee is oblivious. The spider gets into pounce position. It can leap 50 times its body length, even though it has no special muscles. The pounce has to be perfect in every way. Distance, timing, everything. The stakes in this battle couldn't be higher. Even the slightest false move by the spider and the bee will administer a crippling, possibly even a deadly sting. How'd you like to stare into these eyes with your life on the line? <laughs> yikes. The spider got the jump on the bee and now the bee is one honey of a prize for the victorious spider.